Continues. We got another good class of styles. Backyard, much more of the ground game against Armani and his uh, high flying, uh, striking style. Definitely the hard style. Armani definitely influenced by Rob Van Dam. No one's gonna question that, but he's over like Rob Van Dam. Just like uh, when he was in the Alliance and everyone hated the Alliance but loved Rob Van Dam. Resurgence, not a fan favorite group by any stretch of the means. That's not our purpose, but the fans just love Armani. They cannot get enough of him. He, he almost stole the Hunter's show. The biggest show in WWE history. Second match on the card. Kid almost steals the show. Uh, just insane to think about that. Him just walking, uh, walking the top of the table and uh, not falling. And uh, him and Bouncer in that false count anywhere was awesome. They had another. They had three great false count anywhere matches. A great trilogy of matches. And uh, Armani had a great hybrid title run last year, really put him on the map, had a great match with Humberto also. Um, kids, kids fucking hungry, and the fans are uh, fans are all about him. Another great guy, WMWA is, you know, building around. I would say WMWA is definitely in a rebuild stage, like I said. A lot of the veterans took what they wanted, they left, they retired. Dawson, Drake, selfish guys. We haven't seen Big C, we don't know what's up with him. Great match, but a good start. Next week. Or next show, whenever that may be. Two weeks, maybe. <laughs> nah, we should have that. I thought the Mitchell grab. Damn. Kitty twisted. Uh, trying to go for that. Oh, I was like, uh, jawbreaker. I thought maybe try to hit that snap, Mary. Big shuffle kick right there. Oh, he kicked to the arm. Uppercut. Mind his teen off. Another uppercut. I was getting his ass beat right there. Back there. Sorry. Oh, you know what I mean. You know what I mean. <laughs> not, but not you guys. I can tell you guys. Part no problem. Look, what can I say? I'm about to whip bounce his ass today. I whip back your ass tons of times. You ungrateful son of a bitch. Reverse DDT. Shade this thing. Just two. Backer needs to mount some fucking offense here before uh, Armani just has his way with him. Armani is uh, feeling it. He's got that sadistic look in his face. I love it. Uh, this is exactly why I picked Armani for our for our group. Oh damn! Damn! Forking that. Damn! I forgot that. Destroying him. Just destroying him right now. On the rope, he's on the rope. Uh, just barely. Backyard, uh, one of uh, just uh, four wrestlers to be Grand Slam champion. Big C, Dawson, and uh, Drake. All three have just left WWE. We don't officially know what's up with Big C, but at this point, I, I don't know. Same thing with Angel Dust. Been missing since the 100 show. Anarchy's only made one appearance since the 100 show. Don't know where these guys are. But you can always count on. I gotta give some credit. You can count on Backyard. Guy's been here since the very first show. 100, you know, 110 shows later, guy's still here. You gotta kind of respect that a little bit, you know. It's really just me bouncing back here for veterans anymore. Everybody's been blood. Which is not a bad thing, you know. is going through an identity change, you know. 
Choke slam might be in that choke slam. Oh, we got a big choke slam right there by backyard. One, two, and he kicks kick out. out. Oh, kick out by Ronnie. Face. Kick out. <laughs> oh shit. Damn, oh. Joey down. We don't have another route. Ain't nobody got time for that. Come on, ref, what happened there? I'm sorry, Kyle Ref. Everything turned black. That's dirty. Because it happens in two niggers. <laughs> Aaron Douglas. You said that you could race like three months. <laughs> George Bush don't like black people. <laughs> He's a hater. <laughs> I remember when Connie called him a hater. I'm not a hater. <laughs> Kanye, I don't know if people like Kanye West uh, do more damage to your race than anybody else. Just with some girl he doesn't even like Kim Kardashian, knocks her out. Oh, man. Name the baby Norris. Yeah, Norris. get beat up in the second grade. That's hilarious. Up in the second grade. If you know that. Yeah, $40 million a year ain't, ain't gonna save that child. Y'all motherfuckers need Jesus. We're pushing 60,000 YouTube views. You know, just it goes up every all the time. And these are a lot. You know, we haven't done a show in nearly two months, and you're talking about nice, nice spin kick into a cover, back air kicks out. I mean, we're talking about um, our older matches, still getting killer views. You know, we got uh, a number of matches over two, three thousand views. You know, so I mean, pretty soon we're gonna have advertisement. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna make, we're gonna making that internet money. YouTube money. Oh! Oh! Ace of Spades, right? Ace of Spades. There nice. Very nice. This could be it right here. Backyard not going down without a fight. Very close. Very close. Back Back off, Amani. Backyard did, is a two-time heavyweight champion, defeated uh, both of us for that championship. We can both agree those were huge flukes, right? He never deserved to be it. No. Got lucky. Yeah, hell yeah. He's a paper champion. Uh oh, going for that clothesline. Oh, what a duck, what a duck! Oh! That's it, backyard! Armani! A split second away from winning that match. Hits the ace of spades, goes for his patented uh, over the arm kick. Backyard had it completely scouted, reverse into the spear, out of nowhere. Gotta give full props to Armani. I thought he had that, man. That's, that was a robbery. Someone called the police. I'm on right now. Hello, police? Yes, it's been a robbery. Backyard stole the match.